Greetings. I've been using raw therapy for a few years now and I've been working with a new camera. I was finding a bit of an issue. I thought, am I doing something wrong? And if you look at the image here, there is something wrong with it. You can see in the top corners here, it is overexposing or something's going on, like overcompensating. Now this is the raw file from a Panasonic and I thought I was doing something wrong. So I thought maybe it's a lens geometry within the program. So I'll just show you what's going on. So I'm coming over to the transform here. I'm coming down to lens geometry and down to profiled lens correction. Now we can see here is selected the right camera and the right lens combination and it's automatically done that. But as I turn the vignetting off, now we see the image is nicely exposed across the board there. Now whether this is overcompensating because it doesn't look at, it's like it's vignetting to me in the image. So also if I turn the geometric distortion off and you can see here it's compensating and I thought maybe this is overcompensating for some reason I wasn't quite sure what was happening because I'd only been working with the Panasonic for a few months and as you can see here it has been selected correctly so what I had done it was reasonably simple I'll just come up the top here and I'll come over here to the image and you can see the you can see in the image here from the JPEG, it's nice and even, and you can see the lighting where it's coming from, on the side of the face, and this side is evenly lit. So, as we come back to the raw image, it has nice colours, the raw images out of the Panasonic. So if I turn off that geometry, turn it back on, and the vignetting, it's like it's overcompensating for some reason. So I turn the vignetting off, again and you can see there again so I just did a simple test I think everybody has this in their house so um, you know just a, a grill here I know that that is straight but as we can see here you can see the selection here but I know this is straight when I look at it but when I bring the image in here it really is seems to be overcompensating so if I turn this off again the vignetting and I know the light was lit evenly from the center as well. So I turn off the geometric distortion and we can see that it's a lot straighter. And I'm not entirely sure why this is happening. So the simple solution was come to the... Oh, let me just go back there. So the simple solution was for the distortion correction, I can adjust, adjust it slightly from here. Now, if I just work out which direction I need to go in, it seems, you know, it's only a small correction, but this seems to be overcompensating. So, if I go to the left there, you can see, yeah, so we have pink cushioning to the left. So, let me go back here. I'm thinking I just need a little bit to increase center only just by a small amount I think and I believe I'm we're on six there what I'll do is just yeah it seems to just a little bit of a, an adjustment and it seems relatively straight to me here a little bit of adjustment there was uh, it probably wasn't necessary but that's what I've done compared to what it has, the profiles that it's selected. So just leaving this off for the, for the camera and creating a, uh, a profile here, which is pretty simple to make. And I've already done it for the, the Panasonic here, one for, for Profoto and sRGB as well. So if anybody else has had uh, this I issue, uh, I'm not entirely sure, but so it seems to be a fairly simple adjustment there to correct for it and creating a, uh, a profile 
by adjusting the distortion correction.